Oh, that's been much, didn't she? Just be doing the short little anniversary photo event. It shouldn't take all that long. We'll see what happens. Ah, good stuff. Good stuff. All right. All right. Could pick up my mail briefly. Couple of dailies. The check in was just a couple of primos this time, and in a little over a week, we get to roll for Sheelan in with this truly ridiculous amount of prepagens. It's exciting. For that, we do have five blue fades because it's the start of the month, so I'll go get my nothing. This will take me from 48 to 53 on normal, so we'll see what happens. So this is 49, and nothing, 50, more nothing, 51, and more nothing, 52, and okay, purple, nice, and that's just a lion's roar, okay, 53. Yep, alright, well, it gets us a little closer to hitting our pity. Or any kind of pity, and what kind of special event is on right now? Just anniversary one. Okay, did that. Let's crank those dailies out real quick and then get to the short little event. I also could try grabbing some artifacts too, which would be nice. See what happens. Hmm. Okay. Oh, see who comes over this way. Get close, why don't you? Thank you. I. Mm, they're grouping away from each other, which is not ideal by any means. I, mm, oh well. Right, well, put you down. Got a Milani. Come on. Mm, how many are we? Gonna get to work. I supply power to both of them real quick. And you know, we'll switch over to you. Thank you. Hit. Nice. And keep on blasting. And another shot should do it. And that's one done. Okay, let's move on to the next on the list. This time it's zooming around. This should hopefully be one I can show off Kimich a little on. Okay, over this way. Hi, how are you doing? Hello. Why, why do you, why do you seem flustered? Either way, we're doing a bit of grappling. Not too complicated. Oh, okay, well it, that's not anything to be ashamed about. Being busy is often pretty normal. Either way, it's good to see you again. Okay, good. That's just how you talk? Fair enough. So, I... Uh, by? By what? Did you... Eat a, eat a frog or something? I don't know. Are you okay? Uh... Please, please don't vague post. G generally speaking, it's undesirable as a behavior. Well, all right. It's good to see you again. Come on, how many more shots do we need? Okay, well, that actually got them all. How'd that happen? Whatever. Yep. But either way, I uh, I got some. Comms in the pipeline, so hopefully logo banner stuff should be getting updated relatively soon. Relatively. We'll see how that happens. Make things look a little bit nicer on here. See if that pays any dividends. It is what it is. Okay, so after this when we start taking photos. Yeah, this is the new boy. 
the honorary animo boy because there aren't any yet and probably won't be. So he's actually really, really interesting kit wise because he's got this whole effect where he goes around enemies and just shoots at things. It's pretty fun. And we got more. Enemies coming in. Slide up the shield. What's interesting is that he very specifically works well with burning Dendrophus Pyro. Even though it's generally a bad reaction for pretty much everything. But he doesn't deal extra damage by it. It's just the damage he deals gets boosted from enemies being set on fire via burning. It's kind of scoffed. The big thing is, is that he's a Dendro character who wants to be played with Pyro characters instead of Electro. Well, it... I've been playing this game for three or so years now. I would hope that at this point I would know at least a little something about how it worked. Unfortunately, in this... You see this every now and then, how. There are these content creators who are ostensibly all about the game. And they don't even really play it themselves. Either they're just doing the spreadsheet game and not actually playing it. Or they're... Some of them literally have their mods play the game for them. Most of the time, which is just... <sighs> oh, oh. Yeah, was it... What kind of laptop was it? Because the way I would play it was... Before I built my PC... I would run it on a MacBook Air that I had Windows installed on via boot camp. And that was incredibly scuffed. Oh, so are you playing it via Go the Google Play Store? How, how, how would that even work? That's frightening. Okay, well try this out. We'll see how much damage he takes. I... Uh, his AoE is not particularly well suited to fighting groups of enemies like this. Hmm, okay. Cool. Well, let's just go for a bite. And... That's okay. Alright. That killed. Alright. I... When other people are around, we talk about emulation a lot. Emulation might be illegal, but it shouldn't be. Emulation is preservation. And also, it's technically illegal. Emulation is supposed to be legal as long as you own the ROMs in question, which is, well, never actually true, but... The main thing is that the crackdowns that a lot of game companies... And as much as I like Nintendo, it's really... A Nintendo thing, first and foremost, being really angry about emulation. They're not very good at preserving access to their own games. Okay, cool. Good luck with that. Don't get toxoplasmosis. Come on. Oh, we actually ran out of space. Which means I'm gonna need to throw stuff at Goblet for shooting in. This defense goblet is gonna be pretty hard to beat. Come on and HP really? Whatever. Can throw this in as much as we can, and... What? Why does it keep going to HP? Whatever, whatever. And... Finally, crit rate for... It's not all that bad. The big thing with the crit rate would be triggering, triggering Favonius passive, but... We cleared out a lot of trash, so... We want either a defense sands or a healing bonus circle it, and... Really? Whatever. Hmm. Hello, how are you doing? You just missed Kozu. How are you? Good to see you. But, like I said, I'm trying to figure out what kind of poses I want for an- Oh my goodness. He's uh, totally in the wrong place. That one is. Yeah, well, that's life sometimes. You miss these chances and- Oh my goodness. That's right, and- but again, I... Mm, nope, vaporize, whatever. Okay. Come on, come on. Wait, what's dramatic? What are you saying here? And shoot. And just a little bit more, and... Big shot. I... Kinich is interesting, because... I think that 
if you play him really well, his damage cap is theoretically higher than Mohani's, but he needs a lot of external buffs. Well, it... There's some truth in that. It's tragic, but... Can you really disagree? Okay. Just gotta figure out how to get you all back in here. Come on, we gotta... Group you, this should be... Yeah, there we go. Alright, and... Out of the way of that. Thank you. We are hitting everyone, which is good. And shoot, and... Should be able to get another that way. And can we shoot, and... Oh, we missed our chance. Annoying. Right, and keep that pyro out the other turning, which is good. Well, actually, that didn't quite work as intended. Oh, well, I... Okay, and... Uh, it's a bit scoffed. Well, whatever. Interestingly, there may be some leaks on Chaska. They're questionable, but... Uh, some of the typical weak sources said that we may know something about Chaska's set. The obvious thing is just that apparently she's going to fall like Wander, which literally zero points. But what is interesting is that they're still on the idea, which was floated in a dubious leak some time ago, that Chaska's whole deal would basically be elemental absorption, like a lot of animo off-fielders have, but as a DPS, and therefore being able to basically change her damage type to match the element she absorbs, which could be really interesting, especially because it would mean that she would be pretty much useless against slimes, which is funny. At least Paro, Electro, Cryo, Hydro, because she'd absorb the element they had on them and then deal damage they were immune to. But you never really know. Okay, we can do a bit of reputation right now. Hmm. Either way, how are you? It's good to see you again. Okay, oh no, 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 no. Check this. I wonder if it will glow at max. That'd be cool. Okay, heal a trill, yada yada. Power res decreased. Electro res decreased. Cryo res decreased. Okay. Then they got the supply notices. Ember core, we got that. Kakahuato, we got that. Banapa bear, we got that. Okay, cool. So now it's a three. Right, and we should be able to get this to... Oh, 400, which would mean with Shield Dance Quest and then getting Exploration, we should be able to get all of them to maximum. But of course, if I hadn't done Fontaine Reputation the week the patch started because I thought that it'd roll over because they changed the bounty system, and they did change the bounty system, but I still used up my rep reputation for the week, I would have been able to get enough points even without the exploration. Get most of this to max right now. Eh, well, whatever. We'll go do our high top boots, Stone Hut of Echoes. I'm saving this for next week for Shielden's boss, by the way. Okay. It's one of the first times I've ever really just held on to transient resin like that. So, we'll take out Arlish of Rose Team. Should be good for beating up those guys. It's good for everything. Especially since she is the only character whom I have out there. Preferred five-star weapon. Okay, so... Chevy got... Chevy has Fab Lance. That's good. Go over here, start that bounty, we'll be chilling. But I'm trying to get an artifact set for Sheila Net. And that means we have a decently nice, decent defense goblet here, but it rolled in the flat HP twice for some reason. But she really just needs defense, crit rate, and energy recharge so she can trigger a burst for its healing. And crit rate to trigger fab for additional particles. She's really good with Nubiet. The best Nuviet team is going to go from Nuviet Furina Kaza Baiju after patch to Nuviet Furina Kaza Shuanen. It's kind of like the whole Yale on Xing Jiao situation in that ultimately they ended up being best used together, which is funny. So, there you are. Thank you. And oh, I didn't expect that to overload because it was its own overload that got triggered. That's right. Okay, and, oh, that didn't hit. Well, whatever. 
Come on, we're just you two. Take out all the annoying dudes. And, oh, all right. Keep forgetting. Arlequino is really fragile. Okay, and hit and there we go. Nice. All right. It worked. So then, Electro is next, and you're immune to Pyro, right? So this team won't work even if they do resist Electro. I've done this one with that weird Sethos team. Honestly, why not do it again? The rain actually could help things. I don't know, maybe. Uh, uh, let's just see what this is like with the rain. That team is... Oh. Official. Official. Sucrose. Kirara. Do you need to level her because... In that germ theater, one of the next lineups in the next patch is going to be Dory. Going to include Dory, Lewa, and Kirara. I don't have any of them leveled enough to... I'm going to have any of them at 70. That's why I got Kachina to 70. So I could put her on. Hmm. Also got Klee, who I don't have. Honestly, very real chance that the next time some of the characters I don't have come around. The ideal thing for me is waiting for an Inazuma Chronicle banner. So I can roll for four characters that I don't have at once, more or less. Because it's Ito, Kokomi, Aika, and Aito are four of the characters I don't have. And then if Klee and Niwa come around, I might just open the wallet to snipe him or something. God knows. Okay, Kirara, and then... Little Sethos. Still just C1. That's early Chlorine for you. Okay, so let's go over here. Should be chillin', and it's right over this way. Let's hope this works. God willing. We could actually put down Sucrose's burst, just for fun. Okay, and thanks, just like that, and come on, I, oh, I didn't even think about that. I, we're actually outside of the deal zone for some reason. Come on, come on, I, oh, interesting. Unpleasant, unpleasant, and, well, we're actually taking a lot more of them out than we did. Last time, which is interesting. Okay, cool. And two, one, two, one, two, one, two. The dash combos that I have to do to make Sethos work are weird. Honestly, the fact that he sucks makes him more fun to play. And I don't just mean that in a cope sense. Okay. So to get... There are going to be enemies in the water. Let's try to figure out who I want to run. We could have cryo, but we're just gonna use cryo to drown them, really. Okay. Give me a lot last. Bounty of the week. And then, yeah, I should be able to get. Depending on how things go, I might want to do enough exploration to just max out some things next week. Let's get all the rep to max or something. I don't know. Just gotta check to see where things are. Alright, there we are, Perilous. Okay. Come on, come on. So we can just break these, break those. It's that easy. Okay. And honestly, we could just have Fremine. Knock her in, hopefully. Maybe. How about that ice? Come on. And. Mm, this should hopefully do it. We can knock her into the water, and once that melts, well, there we are. That easy. Thank you, Franny. Let's just check what our reputation is at for each. So again... Yeah, yeah. So next week, I'll be able to just do those bounties... So a couple for them, and then I could either do the Shion and Quest. The easiest way to do it would be, especially since with Kawada Pack, I'm almost at 60 exploration, just collect two chests or something, and then, quite frankly, max them out via exploration, and then do the remaining bounties just for people with Springs and Children of Echoes. Because it would be interesting, especially if 
the Obsidian Pillars change in appearance. This have all that reputation max, as well as the two remaining Night Soul Totems. One's in here, one's in here. I can't believe I missed this one. It was literally just on this mountain peak. But I'll do those at the start of next patch, max out that reputation, and then go into the new Archon quest with all the totems, especially since, according to the trailer, we go into the Night Kingdom room with the wild proxies, which, depending on our bonus boss progress, will be some degree of what up or not. Like those couple of quests we did, this one here actually does send you into the same Night Kingdom location as the totems. Again, next patch should also be a Shade of Death appearance, apparently. Slowers. So that'll be interesting to see as well. So let's just check this. Shield Dance quest would also help with... Uh, but yeah, we just need... Two requests, two bounties to get that to max. That'll be fun. So in that case, I... I like the little bit of blue tint there. Yep, so I'm actually the camera event. Mementos of Tevat. Your footprints... Also, I love this. I love this song for this... For the Valley people. Your footprints can be seen in every corner of the land, and wherever you've been, your memories linger in the air. Sometimes those who walk too long a road are prone to forget the incredible things they saw along the way. So it's important to capture moments of the past to look back on, and this is one reason why Palm Hunt constantly pesters you to take photos. The other is that, seeing as the pair of you went to the trouble of buying the photo book, wouldn't it be a waste not to use it? Mementos of Tevat album. An album that features many of the Traveler and Pomons. Mementos are their adventures. Your adventure is not yet over, and you will certainly create many more memories in the future. This album is probably far too thin to contain all the pictures you take and will take. So after it's been filled, don't forget to bow, go buy a new one with Pomon. An honest promotion in Court of Fontaine, Vostry Passage, Fontaine. Take a walk with Pomon. Buy one, get one three. My loss if you buy, your loss if you don't. What sort of global folk would be taken by such slogans? Wait, Pomon pre ordered already. Pymon's camera. Oh, it's got a whole star motif in there. Fabric Fringe. A convenient gadget that records and saves image when used. This one belongs to Palmon. Back when you bought it, you haggled with his seller for ages before finally scoring a bargain on this custom camera, which Palmon keeps with great care. You recall that the seller included a thick photo album along with the camera too, but you've barely seen her take it out. Just what kind of photos has she taken of that camera of hers? Let's go over here. I'm gonna show, apparently, the first characters we met in each place. So I wonder what they'll say for Leeway. Maybe Ningguang? Mm -hmm. Let's go over here. Over to... Oh, and it's the general store guy. That's fun. You know, Traveler Palmon can see that the commission's been pretty taxing lately. It's a thoughtful, capable guy. Palmon's duty is to help you relax. So, ta-da, guess where this is? This is a dam of Ilpa Bear on the sign right in here. The abode of Morathia's graveyard of wallets. Fosako. Over there, welcome to Domaville Purveyor. This is no ordinary store. This is a place for hard-working laborers relaxed via spending money. Indeed, indeed. In fact, we have recently launched a buy one, get one free promotion. All customers are welcome to take part. My loss if you buy, your loss if you don't. What the quest said, yeah. Uh, Palmont saw the event poster when we passed by before. That's how she remembered it. Double the goods for every purchase sounds like a great deal no matter how you slice it. It always feels like there's something missing in Palmont's day if she doesn't spend some more here. So today we're coming here together to fill that gap. And what would you like to buy, Paimon? And how shall this yawning void be filled, Paimon? Eh, not telling you just yet. Payment might get tricky that way. But don't worry, Paimon brought her own Mora today. Boss, has the order arrived yet? It's under Paimon and Travel. We do have your package. One moment. For Sako, the shopkeeper retrieves something over package to be on identification. Be beside you, Paimon fishes out a large pile of pocket money. You detect a hint of sadness on her face as she parts with a sizable sum. Hmm. After you unwrap the package together, you realize that it contains two photo albums. And finally, Pom has been waiting ages to get these. We've taken so many pictures so far, and now we've got a spot to put them. I don't usually see you use a camera. Yeah, that doesn't mean Pomon has never whipped it out. What do you mean by that? She was taking quite a few pictures of you while you weren't looking, in fact. Huh, oh, you know, I'd like to see him now. Let me see. Now, right now, Pomon's got to take a whole album's worth first. And it's so petty. Pomon's a meanie. Bafui. Very childish today. Anyway, take this photo album, would ya? This one's a little thin, but can fit a whole bunch of photos anyway. We've been to so many places and taken many photos for others, but not really for ourselves. Pamon thought it'd be nice if we could keep a few more memories for ourselves, so she bought these two albums. So this is a gift. Hmm. That's right, it was a buy one, get one three deal, BOGO. So it's one for each of us, Pamon had it all figured out even while she was ordering. 
You've got to start using it right away, all right? You can take pictures of the places we've been to, maybe relive some past memories as well. By the way, I want to use Pymont's camera to take some photos. He never used it before, right? It took a lot of effort to custom order this from a department store, so it'd be a shame if we didn't use it more often. Sure, we'll give it a go. Thanks, Pymont. Yeah, as long as you like it, this is what a good guy should do after all. Come on, let's go take some photos. Huh. The journey began in Mondstadt, and Amber was the first nut of Favonites that we met. She accompanied us from the city of Whispering Woods, the city of Mondstadt herself. With the guidance of the winds, we visited many places from the Knights of Favonites to Storm Terror's Lair. Legendary beginning. And the dragon and the adventurer in designated area. Hmm. Should we go to take a picture? Palman hasn't figured out a suitable photo taking spot yet. Take pictures at the other locations that Palman has specified. Uh, so once we do everything other than not one, we get not one presumably. 30, 30. So presumably the final one will be double reward because it's always 420 for the entire event. Okay, Paimon's camera. Convenient gadget that records and saves images when used. Back when you bought it, you haggled with the cell for ages before finally scoring a bar on this custom camera, which Paimon keeps great care. Okay. I read this already, didn't I? It does expire, which is kind of sad. Okay. Let's get this started and... Nothing new. Uh -huh. And all of that in particular. Let me see. Connections. What did he say here again? Connections. Another competitor in almost any corner. Another Meripede. Okay. Let's go and start taking these picks. Let's turn out pretty suddenly. Ward preview. Complete these and then... Story's beginning and the adventure continues. Interesting. Get the photo taking quest. Alright. A legendary beginning weapon must be a sword from 3 to 5 in designated area. Designated area is right over here. When you look back on your journey, this is one of the first scenes that pops into your head. Come snap a picture of it. I. Clearly, they would want you to be using Traveler, I would imagine. Put them in the party real quick. Weary instance of usefulness for Traveler. So let's be Animo again for a second. I really do wonder what Pyro Traveler is going to be like. Hope they're good. So let's just get over here. Which near the beginning. Change the time. Spots over that way. I should put in some mobility in the party, I would imagine. Sorry, Charlotte. Okay. And... On top of that cliff, I would imagine? Probably. Okay. Just like this, and... Oh, what do you know? Crystal fly. Hmm. Why not get rid of that? Get up here, and there we go. Oh, right! Here's Amber. Oh, well. Let's equip Palmon's camera and interact with the photo-taking points or character to enter photo-taking mode. The process is split into an adjustment phase where you determine the position where the photo was taken. Photo-taking phase in which you can move and use your skills. During the adjustment phase, you need to first select your camera position and then proceed to adjust the position and angle for taking the photo. Every photo-taking point is three camera positions, with every position having its own unique aspect ratio. So you've confirmed your settings, it's time to move on to the photo-taking phase. During the photo-taking phase, when using Palmon's camera, the angle of the finalized image will be decided by the settings you previously adjusted. Pictures will be taken from the three camera positions all at once. You wish to adjust your camera settings again. Not real text. You can tap pause challenge and return to your preset, thus starting the setting adjustment process over again. Once you have finished taking a photo, if you wish to continue taking pictures using the current settings, you can tap keep taking photos to return to the photo taking phase. Okay. And they're gone. Oh well. Hey, it's your traveler not voiced. Fancy meeting you in the Whispering Woods again. What are the odds? It's been a while, hasn't it? What have you been busy with lately? Taking photos to keep a record of the places we've been. Taking photos to commemorate my legendary career with. Let's not be prideful. Ah, oh, that makes sense. This place is so beautiful and serene. It really does make for good photos. This is my favorite patrol segment when I'm out on scouting missions. This is where I met for the first time, too. I even mistook you for some kind of suspicious character back then, too. I'm getting embarrassed just thinking about it. After all, it was thanks to your help that we averted the crisis development and restored peace to Mondstadt. But your sister, I put up so many missing posters. But it seems like it wasn't of any help. It's fine. Amber, you did all you could. Thanks, but still, please feel free to tell me if there's anything I can help you with. 
If you're out rather than that's Favonius wants its golden champion, and a friend at your service in that case step into the frame, please, no problem. What kind of foes, pose do you think I should do? Cool, fun, formal. Let's choose fun. Ah, oh, that's fun. Will this work? Let's actually check them all out. It's fun. Fun and formal. Eh, boring. Fun's cute. And it's cool one again. Mm -mm. I like the fun one. Okay. Go awesome say cheese, I'm ready. Okay. Let's check our time. And is this actually the correct time anyway? It is not. Okay. Got to change that then. Cool, just an afternoon. All right. So I, huh? All right. A statue. Photos and, oh, you have to change one, interesting. Okay, ready. For this, you gotta stay in the right spot, I. Hmm. Really go all out. I like the close-up options. Those are fun. Can take close shots with everyone. Cause is an Inazuma. That's gonna be a fun one. Okay, in designated area. Change the time. This looks like we're looking at a statue, frankly. Just must be greater than 30 minutes. Well, we'll sit here then. Okay, cool. And it. <laughs> this is amusing. You know, it's just staring at the totally immobile person. Okay. And. <laughs> okay. Alright. Let's try that again. Actually, this one is funny. <laughs> this is funnier. <laughs> My goodness. Okay. Save for posterity. And. Go to the next. Okay. Well, it worked. On to the next. Oh my goodness. The dragon and the adventure characters in idle animation. Four to six in designated area. It's over there. Hmm. In an idle animation. It feels like it's supposed to be travel associated, but this is one I would imagine that Gets taken entirely on her own, yeah. Okay. Four to six. So we'll take it as early as possible so we have as much time as possible to adjust. <laughs> now that's still unused terrain. So we got that little skin tag in between. Giveaway and Mondstadt. Okay. Hmm. That's... Mm -hmm. So they're all changed independently, interestingly enough. I... Seasonally fine-tuned. I... Face it and... Left. Okay, that's decent. Okay. Number settings are fine. Let's move over. Pinpoint this as much as we can. Wait for that idol. Alright. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, does Traveler not have an idol? Traveler is an idol, right? I... Huh. Just gonna wait a little longer, but after 10 seconds, you would imagine that the idol should start. And maybe I have to do this as someone else. No, there we go. Oh, cool. Okay, that's funny. Just go ahead to your stretch. A little disgraceful, but what do you know? <laughs> I'm just inadvertently taking all these really silly pictures. Okay. Next one is... 
Got those, okay, so it has standard options there. Okay. Collect those rewards after passing Wangshu in atop its giant tree. The shelves of the Guiwei Plains, we arrived in Liwei Harbor. Had an acquaintance in Liwei Zhang and head chef at the Wamen restaurant. Right, because in theory, the first you might meet for sort of opportunity would be meeting her in her story quest. Starts in Mondstadt. No matter how far we've come, we always return to Liwei for the light and ride each year, assembling our old favorites at the Wamen restaurant, spending holidays with our friends. Somewhere you'd want to go when you're hungry. Picture characters from Liwei or is the Traveler. And the fort in the designated area. But, is there a Wangshu option there, or... Let's see. Go over, and it seems... There seems to be one over here. Treetop Pavilion. Hmm. Either way, we may as well switch to Geo. Hmm. Proto Ranker being... Basically the cannon weapon right now is fun. So they had the travel use that in... Uh, starting with not one stuff in cutscenes. Let's go over, find a spot. Over there should be fine. Gonna look at our criteria. Hmm. There's details, and that must be a poor in idle animation in designated area. Huh. That... I wonder in that case whether it might be better to just put in Zhongling. Maybe. Sort of. Maybe Zhongling. I don't know. We could, we could go. Osmanthus one route, but. Even that Zhongling seems to be the character for it. You may as well. That's. No, no, no. There's a hill troll right there. Huh. And for that, it's Forum Idol in designated area. We'll put in Zhongling then for now. Take that pick. Okay. Oh, Machikide, nice. These are all pretty good options, I suppose. Default's not bad. Okay. An idol. How about taking a picture? During the idle animation, let's center you face in there. Go ahead and do something. You could put Globa down just to be funny. Start your idle and hopefully Globa will be there. Or not. Oh, well, he's gone. Oops. Do your idle, please. And that's fun. <laughs> Globa on the head and everything on fire. I like that. Honestly, I feel like this sums up Zhongling gameplay pretty well. Honestly, that makes sense. I wonder if they thought about that, just you can't have the idol store until Globa's gone, because you need to have her stay still for longer than Globa can be on field. To make sure that you don't have double Globa here through some <laughs> profound offense against God. Okay. Let's go over here. The other one, and this should just be... Shawn should show up over here, I think. I've done that with some of the other ones. Yep, and... Yellow and orange and blue. Looks to be the case. Let's go over here. Oh, we still got the music wings. Okay. Oh well. Hi. Travel, it's you, long time to see. Funny, I just mentioned you to Globa yesterday, and here we are. I guess that's what they call fate, huh? All right, where are you headed? I was going to take the picture of this bridge, looking for people to take photos with. Nice option, photo taking. If that's a coincidence, I've taken an interest in that lately myself. I've been using the same poster at the restaurant for so long, it's high time we got a new one. I've been thinking that we could draw a passerby in more easily. Some beautiful shots of our dishes, as the old saying goes, a fine meal is three parts color, three parts aroma, three parts taste, and one part advertising. I haven't heard that one. Of course, I have that last bit myself yet. Dad always talks about the first three. It's as common culinary wisdom as can be. Hardworking is always a jungling. Things that have been challenging have a jungling. Though if anything, my motivation grows the more I do things I enjoy. Finding rare ingredients, creating new dishes, learning how to advertise. I've still got a long way to go in my culinary journey. Hmm. Oh, now that you mention it, it's been a long time since the first meeting, hasn't it? The many things have stayed the same too, haven't they? I'm still traveling, I'm still coming up with new dishes, yada yada. It's my goal not only to keep one main restaurant open, but to make it better and better. 
Yeah, so long as I've got straight to my arms, I'll be surfing, mock tossing, even when I'm in or granny. Huh. Involving drawers, just piping hot dishes from pot to plate. Remember to stop by for a meal more often, alright? I will see. Be nice, alright then, it's a deal. Right, I'm kind of getting off topic. Maybe we were talking about taking some pictures, right? Need any help? You have to step in the frame, please. Sure, that's a piece of cake. What push should I do? Go a little fun, joyful. And, uh, that's fun. Uh, joyful. Uh, go with a weird one. Weird's fun. I'm scared of Zhang Ling. Okay. So what? What would the funniest option here be? I don't know. Maybe looking away. Some way to just not be looking. <laughs> okay, and oh, from behind. Maybe just turning the other way. That'd be funny. Okay. Ten o'clock to fourteen o'clock in designated area. Sure. Facing the other way entirely. Okay. 10 to 14. That's just a little ahead. Alright then. Just like this. Alright. Okay, walking. Okay. Cool. There we are. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so on to the next. Got this. Collect the rewards. Got a pose there. Tower without me. Inazuma, the nation of lightning, is far away across the sea and can only be reached by boat. We met Kaza, a native Inazuma, traveling with a fleet. We've been wandering the world just like us, and together we've discussed many things concerning Inazuma. Heard about the Grand Narukami Shrine's fortune slips and how popular they are among believers. Sometimes go draw a slipper to ourselves when we're feeling lucky, of course. Okay. Her Excellency something Narukami, what a mouthful. Character must wield the power of Electro characters using normal attack in designated area. So, of course, that would mean... Switching. Traveler back in. Okay. Cool. Over there, I... No amber picture for that first one. Maybe we should have done that. Oh well. So it does give you a traveler option for a number of them. Hmm. As opposed to other options too. We went where traveler must be a poem, but... Well, that wasn't an option. You can't make traveler poem. Would be cool if traveler switched weapons between... Trap Poem Traveler for Geo or something. Hmm. Okay. Well, whatever, never mind. Power of Electro. Weapon must be a Claymore or the Traveler is present. Looking down on the world below. Designated area. I. Electro and Kaza would not work in there. It's interesting. Go take the picture. Okay. Oh, that's not the right place, is it now? So in that case, we should probably... I actually forgot there was a waypoint here. Okay. Hmm. That would be right over this way. Okay. That's fun. All of these are good enough. She was using normal attack in designated area. I... Hmm. Let's go over here and then take that normal... We're attacking? That's okay. Yeah, just go ahead and chop the shrine up. Probably should have been facing the other way. Actually, that that's a real cool shot. Okay, and let's see the trail trace behind. That's fun. Okay. Electro. Claymore over the Traveler. I wonder if they'd mean Beto then. Beto Kaza picture? It's interesting to think about then. By the way, here's Kaza. Huh? 
Oh, over there. All right. Oh. The fortune slip I received at the Grand Arakami Shrine stated that great fortune shall be with me and that I should expect a reunion. It seems the reunion was to be with you. It's been a while traveler. We're here to take pictures of Inazuma City, looking for people to take photos with. Oh, an elegant pursuit to take pictures of scenery. One as witness is to remind itself of one's journey thus far. But we said people. What about you, Kaza? I have presently made plans to meet Mr. Nakatsuki at the tea house to discuss the art of this tea ceremony. He is well versed in the relevant disciplines and is a regular there. Are you an expert too? Studied for a time in my youth, but a knowledge then was quite shallow. I found it all the more fascinating while revisiting it for study as of late. For example, the nations differ in their manifestations of said ceremonies, for Inazuma we emphasize the spirit of purity and tranquility. In the West Chowing village also produces tea, and the people of that land lean towards harmony and authenticity. These differences also reflect the two people's differences in loving habits, most fascinating. Real lover of learning a man of elegant tastes, I see. Uh, hardly in truth, I did not return here solely for that. This is the land of my birth, and so it remains, though I was once compelled to leave. Returning every once in a while, seeing people I knew in my youth, spending time in familiar places. I feel as if I still have roots here, which relieves the cares of my wanderings. To use cameras to immortalize such memories is a wonderful idea. Wanderers need our anchors more than anyone, after all. Hmm. Anyway, that's quite enough about me. I don't wish to take up your time, but if you need any aid, simply say the word. Light step into the frame, them, and if you would, easily done. What sort of pose would be best for the shot? Casual, relaxed, deep thought. How does this look? Relaxed pose. It's more smug. Smug's in a deep thought. Fair enough. I like that one. Perfect seat cheese. I'm ready. Okay. And... Normal aspects are nice. It's fun. Mm -mm. Reset. Set. Yeah, these are fun options. I guess we'll be facing each other. Down on the world below. Mm. Face Kaza. Or you could always just put in Beto to be silly, but I think it's a bit plain that the point is to have travel photos. Travel er photos. Okay. Cool. You when I look at Kaza. Man staring. What is he thinking? Okay. So on to Samaru. Take these up and what is that wisp of light? Samaru has both rainforest and desert within its bounds. We met and made friends with Koi, a forest ranger on the way to Samaru City in the heart of the rainforest. After leaving that region, we plunge into sands that stretch across the horizon with the muscle that became desperate, leaving a deep impression. Above portion of an underground labyrinth. Weapon must be a polearm. Characters walking or running in designated area. Sounds like Sino then. Data, dissertations, and examinations. Character must wield the power of Dendro or is a traveler. Control the 14 designated area. Okay. So I probably should maybe be around there, maybe? We'll see. Let's become Dendro again real quick. Alright. Resonate with Dendro. Okay. Cool. Hmm. Let's go over here to our photo taking spot. Should be a coin moment. And it's over there again, yeah. Gonna be here. Should be. Okay. Hello. Hello. Okay. Grandma. Yeah. And, oh, we even got the Numa Burst because we actually hit with a plunge. Oops. Didn't mean to. Oh, huh, what's your travel? What's the plan today? We're here to take pictures from Mirror City. We're looking for people to take photos with. Well, photography, true academic researchers often come here to snap a few shots of the city. The who do are from Vahamana, history, and Kisharwar. Architecture, apparently study urban infrastructure and architectural history or something like that. Well, aren't you familiar with the Darshans? Taking classes in those Darshans by any chance? I'm not a student yet, so I can't attend the classes, but Tionari has introduced some of the basics of their research to me. 
But if you wanted me to take a selection exam, I doubt I'd pass even the first round of the written test. Wish I could reach a level of researcher, of course, but it's still a dream at the moment. And like it's Sunday, you can do it. Koe. So much travel, and anyway, I'll do my best to win the basics first. Honestly, I'm just happy to learn something new every day, and right now my goal is to be the best forest ranger I can be. Guiding those who have gotten lost in the rainforest, helping people who have accidentally ingested poison, protect, protecting the rainforest, fort, and fauna. We forest rangers do lots of things. Everyone needs me, and I'm more than willing to help. I've only done a couple of little things here and there, but still everyone recognizes my work. Guess I'm lucky to have all these people who care about me, and I've made friends with someone as amazing as you. About friends, Chloe, about amazing, don't forget that. Oh, all right. Anyway, if there is anything I can help you with, just let me know. I'd like you to help me with some photos. I can do that. How should I pose? Natural, fun, casually. Pose a slick. Ah, with the doll. Fun pose. <laughs> That's silly again. Casual pose. I will go with the casual pose. Honestly, the quote unquote natural one is kind of freaky. Okay. So. Let's go for it. See the time over there. Danger and the Traveler. Yeah, because if you wanted to, you could actually take a picture of Tinari and Koe, or Beto and Kaza. Mm -hmm. Much to think about. But I don't want to switch. Not right now. I'd have got to put Sino in. Eh, it. I don't know. Actually, let's put in TNT anyway. Let's eh? see. Oh well. And face each other. Come on, come on. Right in there. Okay, cool. And that's. Yeah, good enough. Yeah, we can push things over and- oh, that's cool how the character we use is a little out of focus. Okay, cool. Let's move on to the Sano one, which is actually right by the statue, too. I- Hey, Sed- uh, Sed Traveler. I don't know. I don't care. Mix it up a little. Okay, put in you. What are the conditions for this photograph? Check that out, and this is... Prepare. That's fine. Walking or running in designated area. Walk over and... Oh, not like that. Look for the sand to go. Sand to dissipate and... Walking over. Foot moment. Okay. Nice, and we've already got rid of the sort of fire there. Put those feet away. Got the dogs out. So next is, ah, if you're on the boomerang. Okay. After passing the report built into a waterfall, we finally entered Fontaine, the nation of Hydro. The magician's assistant Lynette put up a grand performance set for us at the Opera Epicles, and we became tacit friends in the process. The romanticism that flows through the Court of Fontaine streets on an ocean breeze will stay in our memories forever. Theater of Fate, Hydro Charge Attack. It's like New Viet. Maybe. City of Operatic Trials. Weapon must be a boat where the traveler is present. Ah, so yeah, they would suggest Lenny, but a poem to put down with Zhang Ling. Would that be two Zhang Lings? Or maybe a Shenha Yao Yao? Zhang Li? Zhao? Hmm. Of operatic trials. What are the final ones gonna be then? Hmm. We can put in. Fontaine bows. You could put in Sigwin if you really wanted to, but the most obvious choice would be. Because the first meeting we had in Samara was Koei and Tionori, more or less. So having that opportunity to put them together and also sort of. Beto and Kaza, even though Beto's leeway for that leeway deal. Hmm. Much to think about. Yeah, putting in characters who make sense. I guess Amber and Kaya, I guess? 
So you did come over? I was wondering if you noticed me. It looks like my concealment failed this time. Oh, well, I didn't put much effort into it anyway. In one moment, show for observation mode off, chat mode enabled. Previous observation indicates that you're more likely to be enjoying the scenery than just wandering about or you're in business. Looking for a good spot for a picture? I'm looking for someone to help with some photos. Photos of you finally decided to end your travels and work at the steamboat. Understandable. The adventurer's income is unstable. You palm on your feet as well. That can be easy. However, they're real slave drivers. Six days of work, one day off. Not even one. You know, I'm a loyal member of the Adventurer's Guild. I didn't expect you to be so earnest about the guild. My apologies for the joke. Did not mean to doubt your adventurous spirit. If you come here to take pictures, they must be of the Court of Fontaine. Sharp as always, Lynette. Many steamboat reporters come here to take panoramic shots of the court, and sometimes they gossip on the side. All I need to do is keep a low profile and listen silently. But having come so many times, I picked up some photography skills along the way, so if you require an assistant, we need model more really. Not my Lynette, could you move into the frame? Understood, I prefer work that doesn't require much talking anyway. How do you want me to pose? Formal, fun, casual. Formal is... Ah, that's fun. Fun. Two thumbs up and a blank face. Casual. Very shy. I like formal. I could try to get... Winnie in here too, maybe. Will he put on that? Let's see. Set, confirm, and... Bow or that. Gotta have a right time. Hmm, I want to see what idols you might end up doing. Two's basically the time we need. Alright then. Cool. Alright. Give me a second. Hmm, go ahead, do an idol. It's looking... Not looking straight ahead is kind of silly. Can we get a little closer? Yeah, we can get a little closer, so... Do your... Do your idol, please. Take your hat off? Come on, take your hat off. It's your idol. Actually... Ah, uh, okay. One with hat off, one with hat on. That could be fun. I'll wait for her to come back and then we'll take the picture. And there we go. I like that one. Shumoku. Ah, oh, he's bowing. I like the I like that one a lot. Okay. So Next one would be Theater of Fate, and that's inside. No, it's right out, right outside. Okay. Put in Nuvia real quick. And we'll have two final pictures to take. Then I think I'll fight Sappho. Finish things out. Hello there. Cool. And let's try this out. Okay. It picks on roses, I suppose, is... That might show up in the picture, though. Alright. And... That's good. Perfectly fine. It's in charge attack. Hmm. Let's float a bit. Middle of the night. You when I float. Oh, and he got the buff I got up. That's a bit silly. Where is your head? <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's funny. So now we got our final options. Take these, Lynette, and you, and... The further we've gone, the more I've realized how vast and lovely this world is. Our adventure continues, and new horizons await our exploration. The story's beginning. Oh, that's right, it... Valley, the beach, right? Weapon must be a sword character is an idle animation in designated area. Right over there. Uh-huh. The end, probably somewhere in that one, I would presume. Actually, in that case, let's put our animo back on. Just like that. Resonate. I didn't notice that bell ringing sound, because it's Ever since I've gotten and started using the PC, I haven't really used. Oh, Traveler's Resonance. I certainly haven't been resonating with the Animo. 
Take a daytime. That's when the game starts. It's daytime. Okay. Cool, and oh, that. Alright. Guess we can go up there and try that after this. Okay. Hello. We're here, traveler over here. Remember this place? It's where our journey began. We've been to so many places since then, time really flies up. Just thinking about it makes Pamon kind of emotional. I wish you could write a poem right now. Let's go right ahead, O oh, Great Bard Pamon. Ah, that's to that. How far have we traveled not yet and seen your full breath? And so, and that didn't rhyme at all. Ah, ah, and ha, huh, and the thought's gone. Ah, do you mean to reflect on how tough this journey's been? That's right, huh? You sure know Pamon well. But seriously, it's easy to forget where we started after all this traveling. For example, Palmon can't quite remember what sweet madams taste like nowadays, and that was one of her favorite dishes, too. That's so why Palmon bought this album in the first place to take pictures of the places we've been the people we've met. He and his close ones, we get back to where we started, and that happens pretty often in light novels and films, doesn't it? That's why we're taking a picture here, not to feel all sad and stuff, but because we hope to always remember the road we've taken. Well, the better to tread the road ahead. Have you been eavesdropping on a conversation with Kaza? Palmon is evolving. Well, yeah, Palmon is listening when you and Kaza were chatting. Come on, we were trying to create an atmosphere here, and now it's all gone. Don't worry, I understand what you mean. Forge ahead, huh? Sure, as long as you get it. All right, your model for the picture is going to be Tibet's number one guide. So what pose would you like to go for? Let's go with the fun pose. How's this? Oh, that's really cute. Let's roll the natural pose instead. No problemo. Also cute. Let's go with the casual posture instead. Too smug. And natural ones. The fun pose is cute. Okay. Let's go for it. Perfect say cheese. Palmon's ready. Okay. I let's reset this. And designated area. And idle animation. It's cute. Wait for that idle. And quest gone. It despawned. Not like it would have been much of anything anyway, but still. Just check and... Yeah, I should be able to get Milani to 10 before next patch starts, so I can just work a bit more and... Good and stretching. Cool. <laughs> and there we go. Someone's paying a bit more attention right now. And the final one will be... Character must wield the power of Pyro. The adventure continues. Character is using charge attack or normal attack in the designated area, but we can't exactly do that yet. Oops. Yeah, it's not Pyro or is the Traveler. It's... Well... Okay. Is it with power? Can't do it yet. Cannot resonate with Pyro. Well, I didn't even... Notice that was an option, because I don't check that often. Especially not as Traveler. Be Hydra or something. That... I wonder if they'll make an exception. They just didn't notate it, or who will have to... Draft someone random in. For that... Mm -mm. Alright. Figure someone out. Maybe we'll put in Dia. Dia Respectors. Unite, rise up, etc. Okay. All right then. Character. Okay. Wield the power of Pyro, charge attack, or normal attack, and they don't make an exception for us. It's actually rather sad. Abandon challenge. Challenge. Okay. Let's. Okay. And. Put in die press for. Change our party out and put in Paro Paro. I've been using Dia a lot and not on. Let's put Dia in. Okay. It's all you. Okay. And grab that sword. And oh, we failed. Oops. Okay. She steps forward, so. Got it. Nice. Mmm. Actually, want to do it during the initial step and before the sword swing. Okay. And 
I? Oh, but it's blocking her. That. I'm trying to make a good image is tough. Okay. Hmm. Hold that down and do a big leap and slash. Hold it behind her, maybe. Uh, let me see. Very meticulous about this. Jump and slash might be cool, but time this very meticulously. And basically, I do that frame one if I want a good picture, and I do. Come on. I care way too much about this. Okay. And. I mean, a normal could work too, but. That's awkward. It's blocking the face. Jump's cool, but. As soon as I hold it down, I take a picture and. That's goofy. So immediately as I depress the button. Gotta. That actually it's a little doofy on the front on one, but you know we take those. That one's nice. And yeah. Dia impact. One of these days I'll get. Actually maybe this uh, that could maybe be cool, except not really. Pose doesn't suit the terrain all that well. Let's collect our last little bit then. Cool. And there we go. Got our album. Okay. And there it is. Check this out. And okay, cool. That's just everything we saw before, but there's no piece of information there and first teleport waypoint and then just spit a novel on it. Sort of pottery chunk or mural chunk, same thing. Okay. Let's go fight Sotho and close things out and that's basically a little under 223 saved up. Yeah, it's a lot is saved up for shilling in. Okay. In that case, I will... Just go over here and... Take out the source of whistles, so... Shilling in needs whistles, other people need whistles. This makes me wish there was a... Local legend story in the farm. I'm sure they'll add that. 5.2, maybe. I don't know. Alright. Dear you. Benny boy. Finish this out with a little fight, but oh, nobody's got their burst up. That is, well, because he died. Let's go get some of that back first. Take down Safo and chill that out. Okay. Cool, cool. Come on, come on. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cool, cool. And just gotta make sure that Emily gets some of that back. I don't for a single shot should get that back for her. Though that killed both of those ones. Mm -hmm. See what happens, but either way, should be all right. Okay, let's go over here. The big thing is, I want to use the burst to prolong a level two case rather than putting it up initially because Steam actually does not generate enough energy as is. Maybe if Diad Fav it would to ensure Emily can always be using her burst. So go like this. Cool, just like that. I, all right, cool. Thank you, and slam you over that way. I, nice, shoot, and 
not jump over that, but try, try, and shoot. I, oh my goodness. What? I just went the wrong way, huh? Oops. Hmm. I wouldn't have thought that would hit me. But, wonders never cease, I guess. Oh. Alright. Just gotta get a little bit back for you. Good old burning grass Bennett moment. If I can't stay in the Dia circle, and even then it kills real fast and real easy. Just because all those hits get vaporized. It ain't great. Walk away, you Diagro, so we can quack the chicken. Whatever difference that makes. Okay, cool ends. Come on, just like that. I. Come on, come on, and shoot. Nice, we got the quick shot off, which is nice too. And except I think that might have missed. Okay, come on, and shoot for the final hit. That was good. Managed to get out of the way, so get back in here. Do your drift. And I. Mm, may as well put that down, I guess, but it did not have. Sorry, wait, the desired effect, and shoot. I. Nice, and cool. I. Uh, don't even think that hit. Come on, I, oh, good lord, I did the wrong thing entirely. That was really insufferable. Come on. Come on. I, uh, with that, and energy issues on the sword, surprisingly. Tough. I, come on, come on, and shoot, and let's actually get this in. Cool, and shoot, and another shot. There we are, cool. It isn't horrible, but she is very, very face which I don't like. Come on, just like that ends. My frames are good. I oh, okay. Shoot ends. I did, in fact, hit, but you're in a very, very annoying location for me at the moment. Hello? Come on, and we'll keep that and reduce the case down. I, come on, I... Uh, who's getting healed in half? Come on, I, oh goodness. Let's try this out and try to mm, heal myself a bit. Okay, this should hopefully help a little, and that's going up some of that. Thanks, and shoot. Get that in, and shoot again. I uh, some issues here, that's for sure. And put that down, refresh that. I try not to die. Come on. It's a lot more high octane this way, but. Won't lie, it is also more than old scuffs. But it's a cool way to fight her. But constantly have an 04 gold whistles for her trouble. That actually is a really good drop chance. And a really good drop rule, so I guess that's our reward for toughing it out. Cool. Yeah. I'll. What are whistles at right now? So have more than enough for shielding it, and maybe even for Kachina. When I eventually feel like leveling Kachina all the way. Again, for the skills too, because she's actually got talents at 666, but that's not important right now. So, alright, thank you. Farewell. Yeah, Melania and Kachina are definitely going to hit. <sighs> Definitely gonna hit 10 by the time next patch rolls around and roll for shielding in. Good stuff. So, in that case, I will close things out for the night. Got our photos. Thank you very much. Sayonara,